we have one, two, three, four, and five. The dark type, congratulations. And what do they win? They win their own box of searching spots. Oh, hell yeah. A whole box. That's crazy. That's so many more chances for Pikachu. Coexley, Zuelas, and Iron Crown. Mesfit, Applin, and Tapu Lele. Meowstic, Peldantoros, and Tatsugiri EX. I do love Tatsugiri. So see. I think particularly Curly Form though. I don't know how I feel about the other ones. Remember, they also have weird names. And we have Slarking EX. It's like, what is it? Curly form, droopy form. And then I think the third one sounds kind of like it's gone off. I forgot they even had different forms. Yeah. Curly, droopy, stretchy. Oh, stretchy. Yeah, look. I just don't know if I'd want my sushi to be stretchy. I don't know, it just feels like in different stages in like food going off. Like curly is when it's good, fresh, yummy to eat. Droopy is when it's kind of sad and kind of on the edge and you might get sick, but you probably won't. And then stretchy is when something's like really up and you really should not ingest that into your system. It's just incredible how only one of them looks like they're having a good time. Yes. Yeah, stretchy does not look like he's having a good time. No. Ooh, be Serena and a Hydragon EX in the full art. So Titan, Menki and Etanatus. Tandemouse Yaga and Rabska. Little Sfeel! Special illustration rare. He's so silly. So silly, goofy. I love him so much. Mouse hold, look at them go. Holy crap. Crocolo and Kilowattril EX. Watril, Beverly Berry, and Skeletoach. Dead End, Glimit, and Scovillain EX in the full art. Rufflet, Victini, and Zarut. Rotom, Gravity Mountain, and Landorus. Yimigul, Bronzong, and Tapu Koko. Molal, Chakadet, and Copper Grigas.
Terrapagos Excadrill and a Pikachu EX. Just our regular boy. But last time we did that, we did also pull the proper one. Is this gonna be like, um, oh god, what was it? Why can't I remember that? Obsidian Flames, where like if you pulled one Charizard, you were bound to pull many Charizards. But otherwise you had no hope. It was like lots of Charizard or no Charizard. Single Leaf, Chocodet, and Togekiss. Enriching energy, Etanatus and Iron Crown. Yes, I agree. I'd love to do a couple of case breaks today. And they're pretty close too. Very. Azumarill, Coriden, and Palusan EX. I believe only the um, dragon type left for the type H case break. That's a, that could be an executor. Or a Latios. Or a Latios. But I do, I do love that when, because it was Paradise Dracona in Japan, and everyone was like, oh my god, a dragon type set? This is the best thing ever. And then the first one they announced was Executor, and everyone was like, uh, hold up. <laughs> This isn't what we thought we were in for. <laughs> Kegleon, Registeel, and Landorus. Quaxwell, Sizzlypede, and a Drayton full art. Latios is psychic? Latios is psychic, you are correct. Jid was incorrect. Stenfisk, Gastrodon, and Etanatus. Shinotic, Vulpix, and Melotic EX. I think the Melodic illustration is also looking very solid at the moment. Got back into the random case break. Oh my God, hell yeah. I feel like a searching box has definitely sucked a lot of people back in. It's got just like, I don't know, it's such a good mix of like classics. <gasps> Yo, that Clubopus, that Clubopus though. Oh, that is such a brilliant card. They're all just so silly goofy. What are they doing? Someone's like breaking coconuts. Someone's smashing a message in a bottle. Someone just whacking a log. I have no idea what's happening. They're just, they're just whacking random stuff. I love that so much. <laughs> it's giving the same energy. I don't know if it's the same artist, um, but it's giving the same energy as the, oh God, what's his name? The monkey guy that everyone hated, and so they made him a silly little card and then everyone loved him again. Oh, it's Simi Yeah, Simi The Clubopus is giving the same energy. Tapu Koko, Elil and Diglett, and Arabska. So Titan, Terra Orb, and Gastrodon. Snorlax, Pansia, and Tapikoko. But no, I think, like, Surging Sparks has done a very good job of, I think, the Pokemon that they've picked for the set. Like, I feel like putting in something like a good Pikachu card is always gonna make a set pretty solid. But they've got, like, a good mix of, like, other, like, favorite Pokemon and, like, some good trainers and all that sort of stuff as well, which is good. Um, that is the break.